And we're back! Hello everybody, Lakota here. And welcome back to Yu-Gi-Oh! 5 Ds Reverse of Arcadia! <clears throat> God, my voice cracked. Uh, so... I just got done doing some serious manual labor. So if I seem a little tired to you guys, I apologize. But I am. <laughs> But I still want to get this video out because we're headed towards an extreme climax that I cannot wait to get to. Um, uh, also, if you guys are watching, you might also notice that there's a few little differences with how the, how the uh, camera and everything looks. And there's a good reason for that. I finally broke down and... I finally broke down, went to YouTube, and started Googling how to do certain things with with uh, Streamlabs. And uh, I think it looks pretty good. At this point, I think it looks pretty good. Uh, I wish I could do more. I wish I had a webcam so that I'm so that I could, you know, put my put a base cam up there because that would be that'd be great, honestly. Excuse me, sorry. Excuse me. But, you know, eventually, eventually I'll get that. But for now, we'll just settle for what we have. Speaking of... Roman! Well, I never expected a non-signer to make it this far. I may be a non-signer, but I've dueled every single dark signer here. So, hey! Why are you why are you here all alone anyway? You want to duel me? Do you really think you can win? I admire that. Though in fact, I'll let you in on something as a reward. As a reward for your courage. The gateway will to the underworld will open any second now. If you want to stop it, you must beat me first. Looking at the time, it will probably open in 20 turns. Try beating me before then. That's right. We play this game under final countdown rules. If I don't win in 20 turns, I don't win. Of course, you'll never make it that far anyway. I'm going to defeat you right now. Okay, saving state, so I don't have to go through that uh, monologue again. And before anyone says anything that he's talking to me, therefore it's supposed to be a dialogue, I'm not saying anything. It's a monologue. <laughs> He's also a villain, so, you know. Monologues are kind of their thing. Woo! I got a star chip! That is basically useless to me. Ha ha! Uh, I think there's something over here, too. Nope. Okay. Hopefully I don't have to refine that star chip in a little bit. Hopefully I can do this in one try, and then we can head on to the actual final duel. But, you know, we'll see. Or, at least, you know, get towards there. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Woo. Like I said, a little tired. I win! Uh, I'll go first. Hopefully I don't get a crummy hand! <laughs> Okay, it's not terrible. It's not great, but it's not terrible. Okay, I got Lightning Vortex. I'll summon Kreebon. I'll set my seven tools of the bandit. I've got Double Summon. I've got Lightning Vortex. I've got a... Ah, crap, I hit the wrong button. I've got a pretty decent hand. As long as I can pull up an actual monster in a little bit, I should be fine.
three bonds is nothing more than a... Oh god, he has his own copy! Yes, I'll activate the effect of three bonds! I'll let you just... I'll negate your frickin' attack! I'm almost positive he has Mirror Force. Oh, great. I'll place Creebons in defense position. And end my turn. It's the only choice I have at the moment. He's just gonna keep chipping away at my life points with Creebon's effect. No, I won't activate it. Well, I got Dust Tornado. My turn. Don't know why I entered the battle phase like that. Okay. I once beat this guy exactly on the 20th turn. If that tells you anything. Ugh. Don't do this. Three bonds is not usually one of my attackers, but I'm tired of taking damage. There. Now you have to worry about me, butthole. I've got a negate attack on the field. So what? It's getting down there. Ugh! Seriously, am I gonna just gonna have to beat this with only Creebon? Useful. And I can't do any damage with him right now anyway. Oh dear. Uh 
Uh, and here comes the slowdown from him summoning a field. From him playing a field spell. Oh, that's an awful noise. Please don't let that play the entire fight. Here comes his Earthbound Immortal! Giant freaking spider. Well, I'm definitely playing Lightning Vortex now! Get rid of double summon. I'll probably regret it later. Fine then. I think I'm still screwed, because I'm pretty sure I can't attack him. Yeah, I can't attack him. But I have a 3800 attack point monster in the field. I lose. I just lose. Let's try this again. Load state. <clears throat> okay. He wins, and he picks to go first. Okay, a lot better hand this time. Okay, 
Okay, so... Better courage! I want to hear a wild heart. Uh huh. And another frickin' tomato. And my turn. You know, the thing is, Double Summon's a great spell card if I can actually frickin' use it. Except in that case, I didn't get to use it. This time I will, though. Okay, let's say. Can he outright summon Uru that way? I feel like he shouldn't be able to. And you also take damage. Ah, Creebons! Great! Alright. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I have a way to beat that. Just to be safe, because I don't trust you. Because why the heck would I? Now you know exactly what I have planned for you. Can you dig it? Uh-huh. Not gonna mean a darn thing in a couple of seconds. Still not gonna mean a darn thing in a couple of seconds. Spell or trap cards until the end of the damage step. Once per turn. I'm gonna put one face up monster your front of controls to this card.
Okay. Not going great. Sorry, I'm doing math. So that's 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. We'd at least be even, sadly. But only during the battle phase. Summon! be one of those episodes where I only get one duel in. Oh boy. I've got nothing. I can't I can't win this. Try again. In case anyone hasn't figured out, that's my way of conceding without going through the long, tedious game over sequence. Okay. I'll go first. Good, actually. Keep those in my hand for now. Excuse me. Nine hundred. 
5, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 15, yeah. I'm gonna equip Comrade of Landstar. Black Pendant. Gonna equip Lucky Iron Axe. To Twin Sword Marauder. Whatever. He's got the hand advantage again. See what happens. Okay. None of my monsters in defense position. And the moment you attack, I'm just gonna suck. <laughs> A freaking course. Mulligan, I don't usually do this this early in a duel, but I'm sorry. I'm blanking, and I hate it when I blank. I'm sorry. I will try not to do that again. Okay. Fix to go first, because of course he does.
I'm thinking, guys. I really am. I'm sorry, dude. I'm sorry, guys. Okay, this is just gonna be one of those duels where I'm probably gonna be doing that a lot. Because not only do I have to win in 20 turns, but he has this bad habit of just pulling the cards he needs. I'll go second. I'm just screwed. Not anymore, I'm not. <coughs> Bye, Creepons. I will activate Dark Bribe. Take slightly less damage. <coughs> Lord, I wish I had urgent tuning right about now. those who don't know, Urgent Tuning is a uh, trap card, I think I've mentioned this before, that the moment you activate it, uh, the moment you activate it, you can sync or summon with whatever monsters you have on the field. Oh, lovely.
Got him down to 500. If I can just hold out.
Alright. Uh, Lazar can either be really freaking easy or really freaking hard. Or really, really dumb. That is also true. I'm going to try this. So let's get right to the point. Show me your true power! I'm sorry, does his dual disc have a clown face? Okay, no, it just looked like it did. Uh, so I'm gonna go first. <laughs> so, the thing about Lazar is he uses a Jester deck. It's based around one particular monster. Ooh, okay, so I'm... I'm pretty well set right now. I summon Gene Warp Warwolf. Most of his monsters have really low attack points. That much I remember. Uh-huh. 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 Okay, I've got Lightning Vortex and Gregeki Break. Shield Crush first. It was a good thing that I did that. I freaking hate Giant Germ. Hopefully I don't get Mirror Force. Okay, I'm... I'm not... trying to sink or summon, I just want to hurt you. Like a lot. So attack. Negate attack. Great. Alright, alright. Main phase two. If I could get a dragon monster out on the field and summon a uh, strong wind dragon, I'd be pretty freaking golden. So basically, Lazar's strategy is based around getting a bunch of cards in his bone trap card zone. And hurting you with, uh, and hurting you with the effects of his, of his monsters. Ooh. Ooh, I could Bryonac. Except I can't, because I can't Secret Summon yet. Dang! I get so little opportunity to summon him. No. Nine times out of ten? Okay, it's not. It's Jester Lord. Good. Okay, direct damage. And have some more! And yes, I know I can Regeki break his trap card there, but not worth it. Regeki break is if he pulls, if he actually manages to pull off his combo. Okay. No, I won't. Well, I know what card he's playing. I know what card he's gonna play, so, you know. Yeah, there's no way he's not playing that. Nine times out of ten, he did that because he's got no other monsters in his hand. No, I'm good. One more turn. I thought I got rid of this card. Do I strong wind dragon? I feel like strong wind. I feel like strong wind dragoning. Yeah, I'm gonna do it. Yay! 
Yeah, I'll tribute Kribons. Maybe that's a mistake, but... I'll find out later. I take 500 points of damage. And he summons two more giant germs from his deck. In attack mode! See what I said about this duel either being very easy or very difficult? Okay, uh... No, I'm not gonna activate it. Taking 500 points of damage. Worth it! Okay, so what you doing? What you doing? That's what I thought. Well, yes, I will activate the effect of a card, because why the frick's not at this point? I'm gonna end this duel. <coughs> if I'm gonna end this duel, I'm gonna end it in style. Ain't no kill like overkill! Strong Wind Dragon! might come here. All right. Excuse me. Akiza, you stay here too. No way. I'm going in. I promised Misty that I'd do whatever it takes to protect this world. Fine. Just don't do anything crazy, okay? Excuse me. All right. With that, I think I'm going to call it. Uh, that seems like a that seems like a pretty good stopping point before we head on towards what I know is the final boss battle. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked it, uh, like and subscribe. If you want to know whenever I post new videos, ring that bell. And I bid you all goodbye.